So your best bet is to remove the entire thing as though it's a tumor, because actually it is a benign tumor. Okay, what we have on this young man's ear is a keloid that formed after a piercing. Keloids are hypertrophic scars that grow beyond the border of the actual incision or the wound or the injury or whatever it may have been, in this case, the piercing. Keloid scars are very different. They have an unusual amount of fibroblast activity. Fibroblast is something that come into an injury or a wound and starts producing collagen so you can biologically glue everything together. So in a keloid, you have exaggerated fibroblast activity, collagen and growth, and new blood vessels growing into this, what is now a benign tumor. If you're really gonna deal with this properly, it needs to be surgically removed. So now in this next photo, you can see that the keloid is now gone, but you'll notice that even though the keloid appeared to be hanging off the back, there's stitches in the front of the earlobe. That's because this keloid is like an iceberg. There is scar tissue that's inside the healthy earlobe, and that fibrous tissue is grown into the healthy tissue around it. So you have to take it out all the way through the ear. A lot of times you have a very good chance of it not coming back but there is a strong tendency for keloids to return after they're removed, especially if they're removed improperly. If you simply cut that keloid off the back of the earlobe and didn't take out the involved fibrous scar tissue inside the earlobe, it would come back for sure.